Hi everybody, this is Melissa from the library and I'm here to share with you some really fun craft, a really fun craft that you can do at home with some items that you may have um, just lying around or perhaps like right now, toilet paper tubes. I'm sure you guys have a lot of these at home, but we're going to make a cute little butterfly out of a paper, a, a, a toilet paper tube, some paper, some paper, yay, and a ruler, some scissors, some tape, it's perhaps some glitter and some other little fun things that you might have at home, and most importantly, some glue. Um, so to start this craft, um, what I did was that I pre-cut a, um, a heart out of just regular copy paper or anything to use as a template for the wings for our butterfly. So our first thing that we're going to do first is we're going to get a piece of paper. It'd be nice. So the reason why I chose the ruler is because so you can um, measure how big and how long certain things are so that way you can fit the paper roll correctly. So what I would recommend for this particular one is you grab some tape, cut a little piece out, you grab it, you grab your piece of um, pre-cut paper, you place it around the tube as such, so for example like this, and then you put the piece of tape right in the middle so it can hold it down. And then what you're going to want to do is tape it nice and firm. And obviously when you're doing this craft, it's nice to do it with a parent just in case so they can, she can um, he or she can help you make sure that you have everything in set. So this is how it goes. And then what you want to do is to carefully roll this around the paper tube as such. You might have some extra paper, which is totally cool. It just keeps everything in line. Once you have it perfectly set, set, make sure to hold on tight to it. And then you want to go ahead and grab some more tape to hold it down. So for this particular step, you're going to need at least three, well, three pieces. So one right here on the top and another one in the middle just to hold everything nice and firm. So you can use any type of paper for this. You can use copy paper, pen, paper. You can use any type of paper. Um, I'm using cardstock because this is what I have here at home. You can also use construction paper or whatever is in your availability at home. What I also recommend is that you grab another piece and put it right on the sides to make sure it stays. Then it looks like this. Another good tip is that um, you don't necessarily have to use the colors I use. You can use whatever color you'd like. You can even use newspaper which would be super, or magazines. Like that would be super awesome. So the next thing is to, to make the wings for our body. And to do that, we're gonna use our pre-cut heart and we're gonna trace it on this paper. Since um, butterflies have two wings, we're going to um, trace it. So we're gonna use our handy dandy pen, or if you have a marker, or even a pencil, anything works. So what we're gonna do is we're going to trace it, as such, and then. So I know sometimes during when we have to stay at home, it's kind of tough to find things to do. So this is when creativity plays key. And then we're going to make another one. Should I could show you how these are turning out. They don't have to be perfect either. So they can turn out whatever shape they come out. And then voila, once I'm done tracing. So I'm done tracing them. So this is how they look like. Next one I'm gonna use is I'm gonna use the scissors to cut these out as such. So be careful if you're doing this at home, you can always do it with your, like I said, these craft, the craft that I'm doing would be recommended to do with your mom or your dad if you're lit, if you're under five, I would highly recommend such. Then we're gonna go around. I like to cut, but sometimes I'm not very good at it. But, you know, whatever it works. There's my uh, first heart. And then my next heart is this one. And then once we're finished with that. Oh, 
I should play some music during this so that way it's not so weird. But anyhow, we're gonna push this stuff aside. And now we have two hearts. Next thing we're gonna do is that once these are nice and cut out, we're gonna put them on our body. To do that, we're gonna grab another piece of tape or some glue, whatever works, and then we're just gonna tape it onto the back of the back of the butter. And then go bloop, plop it back, plop it on. And then you have your first wing. Next, you're gonna cut another piece of tape. And you're going to flip it on. You can do it overlapping, so this is how it looks when you tape it on. You can either tape it on as such, so it can look like that, Super. or you can do it however your heart desires. And there you go. You have two wings. I think this one I did too big. Okay, let's put this one a little bit out. Practice makes perfect-ish. <laughs> and then, bloop. That one looks a little bit odd, doesn't it? Eh, looks fine to me. But there is your wings. So you're probably thinking, where are my antennas at? So to make our antennas for this particular one, you can use pipe cleaners, you can use whatever you have at home. Um, you can even use some, um, what is it, Q-tips for the ears. Be creative, do what you gotta do. For this one, I'm just gonna cut some tape from here. Some leftover paper. The only thing that you wanna make sure is that they're somewhat even, so that way they don't look very odd. I'm just gonna cut them as such. And then, bloop, cut them. And there you go, two antennas. So then to put glue antennas on, we're gonna grab some more tape or some glue. And we're going to put it on the inside of our butterfly. And then we're just gonna glue it on. Or I'm gonna actually put them together and then I'm gonna glue it on and then we're gonna go we're gonna do it on the inside right here and then once we're done we have antennas they'll look a little bit weird but that's totally cool right so then the next thing for this is that we're gonna do is we're gonna put on a cute little smiley face you can either do that with markers crayons whatever you have or a pen or I have some or I have some fabric paint here at home and some glitter but I'm actually gonna save the glitter to decorate the wings so then when I'm gonna use the fabric paint, and then I'm gonna put some dots for my apples. Remember, be, you do what you can. Doesn't have to be perfect. Once we're doing that, it's the time to be careful while we do this. And we're going to, if you'd like, what is it? Decorate our wingies. I'm do some dots with some glitter. Because who doesn't love glitter? You can also do whatever your heart desires. You can draw on them, you can do whatever you'd like. And then. You're good. And then if you use fabric like paint, like I did, you have to let it dry so we can't play with it or do any of that stuff. Once you're done with that, you're done. And there you go. Your own cute little butterfly out of a toilet paper tube. Um, these are super easy to do, so um, you can do whatever combination you'd like. Um, but Enjoy sometimes, enjoy time with your family while you're in quarantine. <laughs> and um, always check out the library for more fun content. Thank you.